With the wire box securely mounted, the next step is to make wiring connections. Install conduit between wall connector and the electrical panel and pull wiring between the two points. Wall connector accepts up to five conductors, line one, line two, line three, neutral, and an equipment grounding conductor. For basic operation, wall connector requires an electrical connection to line one, neutral, and positive earth. Connections to line two and line three terminals is supported for some grid types. Some installations will utilize the terminals on the back of the wall connector unit for auxiliary communication. For additional details on communication wiring, watch the video for dynamic power management. When conduit enters through the top of the enclosure, terminate neutral and line three wiring, then route the line one, line two, and earth conductors through this channel and secure them with a zip tie here. When conduit enters through the bottom or rear of the enclosure, route the line three and neutral wiring through the channel and secure with a zip tie. Strip the end of each wire and terminate it in the corresponding terminal. Use the included hex bit from the accessory bag and a torque screwdriver to tighten each terminal to the listed specification. Visually inspect each wire to ensure that a proper connection has been made. All strands for each conductor must be neatly seated in the terminals and insulation must not be pinched. With wiring terminated and torqued, the next step is to attach the wall connector unit to the wire box. Align the wall connector unit over the wire box and press inward, engaging the contact blades into the sliding contacts. Apply pressure to the faceplate and secure wall connector with the four included fasteners and hex bit. Do not use a drill to install these fasteners. Hand tighten these four fasteners to finish the installation. Neatly wrap the charge cord around the housing counterclockwise and secure the handle in the side dock. Wall connector is now ready for the final steps, turning it on and commissioning it for use.